good morning good morning everyone and how are you guys doing today so it's Saturday and this is when I usually come home but I start a three-day trip today and it's not it's not bad it's good today we do a Savannah turn and then we come back to JFK my schedule was much longer but because of cancellation and stuff my schedule have been reduced um, I hope that you guys have been keeping up with my vlogs and then you see that I went to recurrent and I passed and you have to go watch that video so I'll leave a link so you guys could see so I'm on my way to my crew room because I forgot my water bottle um, on the plane luckily they found it I completely forgot about it because that was in a rush and they call and ask if I forgot a water bottle I was like oh yeah I did <laughs> so um, walking to my gate it's pretty full here today like really full hold on look as you guys can see when I walked in there was like a lot of people in the line but it's pretty full here today I just went to my room and get my bottle now I'm going back to the gate and they're checking these lanyards to see if they're easy to break because they have some new ones that's not easy to break I guess it is of an emergency or something so off to Savannah I go so guys I'm on the aircraft I'm gonna do my checks for the aircraft seems to be a good plane so far um yeah so as I said we're gonna do a savannah turn and then come back and then I'm finished and then tomorrow I actually dead head to Minneapolis very early in the morning and then I have a sit in Minneapolis and then I go from Minneapolis to Newark and then we're done and then Monday I do um Newark to Detroit then I have a uh, almost five hours say five hours sit in Detroit but they gave me a hotel so remember I said anything after four and a half hours they give you a hotel so I have a hotel and then I go to um and then I dead head back to New York and then I'm finished and then yeah I have a few surprises for you guys well a few surprise travel vlogs for you guys coming up so stay tuned with that I have some stuff to deal with and I'm gonna take you guys along. I won't show everything because some are a bit personal, so yeah. Um, so I'm gonna do my checks and then I will check in with you guys later. Hey guys, so uh, we made it to Savannah and they cleaned the plane and everything is good to go. Now we're just waiting to board. And I completely forgot that um, today is four years I've been with my company 10 10 16 that was my hiring date 10 10 16 so today is October 10th 2020 and I cannot believe that it's been four years already oh yeah disclaimer I am NOT around anyone so that's why I don't have the mask on there's no one on the aircraft I'm by myself I just want to make that uh, let you guys know that because I saw a comment that said that I needed to wear my mask properly but when I don't there's no one around me so I just wanted to make that clear but back to what I was saying it's been four years since I've been here and I just cannot believe and I'm very grateful that I'm even here for four years um, of course it has ups and downs being a flight attendant but I wouldn't trade it for the world you know what I mean what job is perfect anyways you know so I'm very grateful to have a job now and for even during what's going with what 
ugh, even with what is going on right now I'm very grateful to even be celebrating a year four and so yeah four years and I'm excited so we're gonna head back to JFK now and then I'm gonna go home I can't wait to go home because I want to sleep and I have to go do laundry it's laundry day I usually wash on Saturdays but I'm at work so going home to do laundry and yeah it's a very quick trip just the Savannah turn and then tomorrow we deadhead to Minneapolis and then from as I said from Minneapolis we have a sit in Minneapolis and then um, from Minneapolis to Newark so we're gonna get like a lot of Newark routes because New York is skin is still kind of on lockdown so they're letting our trips flow through Newark a bit and we have a lot of our flights that go into Minneapolis or Detroit yeah until New York gets back on their feet I hope soon because you know I need people to start flying so that flight attendants could come back to work and be happy because right now is just such a very sensitive time for flight attendants and I just want everything to go back to normal so we don't have to worry you know but nonetheless yeah but um waiting to board and then we're off to JFK so I see you guys maybe tomorrow when I pick back up the camera see ya the next day good morning everyone so today is day two of three and as you guys know I overnight in JFK we had a hotel here but I went home oh my god guys do you see how crowded well it's a little busy this morning and I love that that's a good sign I hope that's a good sign for the airline I hope that it seems that um, people are flying more and I love that outside is like full it's beginning to start well it's starting to look like JFK again terminal 4 so I'm excited about that anyways so I am deadheading this morning to Minneapolis have a almost four hours sit and then I operate to Newark New Jersey so yes come along with me it's day two of three currently on the aircraft dead heading to Minneapolis do, do, do. Today I have not been vlogging. I know I haven't been vlogging. So I had a sit in um, Minneapolis and I was just there. I think I have a little small clips I would show. So I'm here in Newark and I'm gonna give you guys a little room tour. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
So they said there's a mall close by, but it's like after four and I'm just ready to wind down. It's been a pretty interesting day. So, and guys, the airports look full and fuller. I am loving that. I'm loving that for the airline. I hope more people continue to travel because this will help the airline industry out in so many ways that you guys could possibly be possibly imagine i wish everybody start flying for for them to call back flight attendants to come in and work that's my dream and i hope that could happen but this morning when i went through jfk it was a little full and yesterday even when i i left jfk it was a little full so i'm liking the signs of that i hope it continues and this would be a great this is a great direction i think for the airlines so yeah but anyways i'm gonna wind down and everything and i guess i'll see you guys in the morning tomorrow we only have one flight to detroit then we have a five hour sit and then after that they give us they gave me a hotel so i might have a hotel in detroit and then i go home tomorrow and yeah i'll see you guys in the a.m <laughs> hey guys good mornings good morning so today's day three of three and i'm currently getting ready to go to the airport um it's rain <clears throat> excuse me it's raining right now in newark new jersey i know we're supposed to be getting some of the weather from the hurricane that's going on so we're getting some of that right now so about to go comb my hair and yeah i'll see you guys at the airport a look see look at the little ducks and stuff and they're enjoying the water and the rain this morning rainy day hey guys so just got on the aircraft and I'm about to start cleaning and doing my checks got my gloves on and ready to clean today's a full flight so I like that because as I said, keep saying it's a good direction for us. So right now we're doing 70% um, of customers on board. So all the aisle seats are like empty. Everyone has their seat. Before they used to like every other seat passengers used to be there. So that's a good sign. Um, gonna hurry and clean and then I'll see you guys maybe when I get to Detroit. <laughs> Hey guys, so I just made it to Detroit and I'm gonna grab something to eat and they gave me a day room so I'm gonna go there as well. 
Oh, there's more. See you guys. Um, restaurant in Con um, in Detroit called Coney Island guys it's so good so I'm gonna grab something to eat and then head to uh, the hotel this is one of everyone's favorite hotels so I'm glad I get to stay there and then my flight is at 3 something in the evening um, it's now 10 something in the morning so I'm glad they gave me a day room because sometimes they don't be given a day room, but I got in after four and a half hours early, so I got one. So let me hurry and go grab something and then go to this hotel. So guys, when I come here, I usually get to number five. It's so good. just made it to my hotel room so I'm gonna eat and then change and then I see you guys when I'm dead heading back to New York guys so 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 much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and tell a friend to tell a friend about my channel and I hope that you're enjoying my content so far also guys be on the lookout for vlogs ahead it's gonna be a little exciting all right love you guys for watching have a good evening <laughs> 